Hi, Helen Matthew here for G-Source. Today I'm in Oxfordshire and I'm looking at a multi-species project, species project that we're involved with. Um, the project is particularly about improving soil quality, soil condition, combating arable weeds. So this is a, a, um, a three-year lay or three-year lays in an arable rotation. Behind me here, as a comparison, we have HSG3. This is our standard um, grazing mixture, intensive grazing mixture, rotational grazing mixture, predominantly for sheep but also for cattle. It contains all diploid, intermediate and late perennial ryegrass. So we're looking at Abergreen, Aberzeus, Aberwolf, Aberchoice uh, and Aberaven. And in there we also have a kilo of white clover. So a premium lay, thousands of acres of that are sold every year across the countryside. Behind me on this side, we have the multi-species sward. So when we say multi-species, um, we're looking at grasses, we're looking at legumes, and we're looking at, at um, herbs. In this case, the grass species we've got in here, again, are the Abba high sugar perennial ryegrasses, a little bit of Timothy. Our clovers are um, white clover and red clover, so it's Abba claret uh, and Abba pasture, the, the, the pasture grazing mixture, and the herbs, are plantain uh, and puna to chicory. Now, anecdotally, the farmers told me this morning that uh, he took he took the store lambs off here, took them to the local market. There was a, a store sale of four thousand lambs. His lambs made the top pen. They were worth about eight pound a head more than they were last year. So we've got one police farmer already. I'm going to show you now the species that we have within the sward. Okay, so here's the chicory, you can see that. Here's some of the red clover, obviously it's taller. There's something else eating this besides sheep, you can see there on the, on the edge. And here is the chicory that's just starting to, to tiller, that's producing a seed head. It can be very aggressive at this time of year. You can see there the white clover as well in the bottom. Um, and obviously the, the beautiful perennial ryegrass. That's a Timothy plant there, that one. Um, it just makes a just a great looking sward and fortunately the, the chicory is just getting away a little bit on us now So we're gonna have to think at how, how we manage that. This was sown last August. We've got one very very pleased farmer here Any more information on this please go to gsource.org